Welcome to Term 2, Week 6, Online News. And just a reminder, put your bags in the hawks on, on, in your classroom and then go head down to the cola in the morning. And also, big picture Friday this week. Um, no, next time we do it is about our home. And PWSA is really fun, so you might want to get learn, to learn how to play soccer and netball. For the next five weeks, Big Picture Friday is based on my home. I hope that everyone can be creative for this topic. We interviewed Miss Bartlett. Here's her interview. Thank you for coming on to the online news. You're welcome. What class do you teach? Well, on a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I teach 5, 6 p.m. And then on a Friday, I have 4, 5 b. Do you ever have us, like, 3, 4 a.m. or... I have had you guys, classes? yes, I've had you once. So, um, on my days off on a Thursday, I'm happy to come in if a teacher is sick. That's when I get to come in and be on different classes as well. Hmm. Why did you be decide to become a teacher? Oh, I think I knew from when I was in primary school that I wanted to be a teacher. My dad was a teacher and when he used to bring his stuff home from school, I used to take all of his, his things and pretend I was standing at the front and being a teacher as well. And once school finished and I went to uni and here I am, I'm a teacher. How long did you go to, to uni for? We go to uni for four years and you study all different subjects and you can come out majoring in different things. So I came out majoring in PE and that's when I used my PE, I lived in Melbourne for a little while and I taught high school PE in Melbourne and then I was up in Townsville and taught primary school PE and then just went back to the classroom. So you've been literally everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> well, I haven't been over to Western Australia, uh, but I have taught in Queensland, New South Wales and Victoria. Yes. Wow. So how many people are, are in your family? I have two beautiful children. Mason is six and he's just started kindergarten and I have Archie who is four. And so while I'm at work, Archie goes to preschool and he also has some days with my parents who love looking after him. What's your partner's name? His name's Reese. Yes, he's lovely. <laughs> I do. I have a cat named April and it wasn't long ago that she had four kittens and I brought the kittens into school. I know that Ben saw lots of the kittens and had a play um, but I'm back to the one cat which I'm happy with. And that's it. What did you do with the other four cats? We, we sold them off to families so they're living with new families and it was good because my kids got to see that they went to the different families and now they're loved by, the, by other kids, which is good. They must be happy. <laughs> oh, they are. Very happy. Yeah. What do you like about Glendale's public school? Oh, Ben, what's there not to like? It's a lovely school. We've got lovely kids that go here and wonderful staff. And Mr Price is fantastic. And it's just a really welcoming school. So for my first year here, I absolutely love it. Mm. Is this your first year? Yeah, it is. First year at Glendale East. Oh, I think it was last year too. <laughs> Very memorable. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for being on, 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 the, on the online news. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. Thank you, Miss Bollett, for that interview. Now, that's all that we have for this week. Bye.